Hi, I'm Paula from MeMakingThings.com and today I'm going to show you how to make a musical staff felt board. So I have one right here that I've made and I'm going to show you how I did this. So what I started with is a, a foam core board and I just cut it in half to get this size. You could make a larger one if you want to, but this is the size that I chose to do. Um, so all you need to do to put the felt on is to cut your felt to size. You can just trace your board and then glue it down with some craft glue or some uh, hot glue works really well also. So to make the line or the staff, the lines of the staff, what I did was um, I decided where I wanted to start right here. And this is about an inch and a half apart. Um, and you can make it any size that it, it depends on how, how large you want to uh, make your board, but that's the way how I started. So I just measured along uh, at a regular interval here. I'm going to start down five inches apart and I just made these little, made these little dots here so I could see where to place my straight edge, which I'm using this piece of wood as a straight edge here. And then I just lined up my dots there. I got that one a little bit low and just made a line like that with a magic marker. This one I'm working upside down so I can see I got it a little bit crooked, but that is how I achieved these lines here. So the next thing you want to do is you can draw either your, your base clef or your treble clef. And then you want to have some notes to put on there. So the way that I made my notes was I needed a little a note shape. So instead of just trying to draw one freehand because it wouldn't be very even, I folded a, a paper in half and just drew half of it like that and then cut it out and open it and then you should have a pretty even uh, note shape there. And I made this little cardboard template. And then the easiest way to do, uh, to get a pattern or to cut out a pattern on felt rather than pinning it on is to use freezer paper. And what you do is just take some freezer paper and then you take an iron at um, almost the hottest setting is what I use and then you uh, iron the paper down onto the felt and I did that previously so it's uh, it's stuck down there this actually has come it comes off really easy you can see it's a little bit where I just put the iron it's a little bit sticky there so then I took my template here and traced uh, all these notes and then I cut them out and there you have as many notes as you would like to make and the felt will stick to the felt. And then you have a felt staff board. This is Paula from MeMakeyThings.com. Have a great day.